Welcome to DroneLink. DroneLink has now added support for onboard waypoints. To date, DroneLink has been using virtual stick technology, requiring constant communication and allowing almost anything you can fly manually to be automated. This also enables missions for drones like the Mini and the Air 2 that don't support onboard waypoints. Onboard missions are uploaded to the drone, which has some pros, such as continuing flight when losing connection, but won't work for virtual stick-only drones. On board with DroneLink, you still get advanced DroneLink features, such as multi-component missions and 3D mission previews. Let's convert this mission to an onboard one. Click on the three dots just under the mission name, and then click Convert. Select DJI Waypoints, and wait for the analysis to complete. A converted mission will appear, and down in the bottom right hand corner, you'll see a Finish Conversion button. If you have a strategy option, then Single will create one mission that will be uploaded to the drone. Multiple will create multiple missions that will be uploaded to the drone one at a time, and has the benefit of more closely matching the original flight. This is recommended for larger multi-component missions, primarily because DJI has an upload limit of just 99 waypoints. Waypoint spacing can be adjusted as well. Let's just use the default. Once converted, a new mission will be created, ending in hyphen DJI waypoints, but your original will still be there. Now let's run a waypoint mission and disconnect the drone to see what happens. Once the mission starts, you'll see onboard waypoints uploading at the top of the screen. Once the mission is running, you'll see onboard waypoints running and a WP next to the drone icon to indicate we're running in waypoint mode. If we fast forward to where I simulated a drone disconnect by shutting down the controller, you'll see that we get a disconnected message and a message saying that the mission has stopped. Mission stopped. But if we switch over to video of the actual drone in flight, you'll see it's continued without skipping a beat. If I then restart the controller, after a short period, you'll see that the drone reconnects and the mission continues from where it left off. Starting mission. If you don't want to convert an existing mission and just want to create a series of waypoints with actions, you can do that by using the DJI Waypoints template when starting a new mission. Thank you for flying with DroneLink.